603 and the trial of a Baltimore County man charged with attempted murder of two police officers continues today. David Linthicum is charged with shooting one of those officers during a call for mental health crisis and another during an extensive manhunt. Dennis Valera is in your corner breaking down the testimony that we've heard so far. Dennis, good morning. Mianna and Tim, good morning. This week we've heard from David Lithicum's father. He was the one who initially called 911 on his son. We also heard from the two officers Lithicum is accused of shooting. Now the jurors, they also saw some body camera footage that showed them what happened when officers responded to that 911 call, as well as what happened when one of the officers were shot during the manhunt. Now, a lot of the Baltimore County police officers that responded to Cockeysville that fateful day took the stand this week. Tuesday was when we heard from one of the officers who were shot, Officer Barry Jordan. He described running out of the basement when shots first rang out. Jurors were even shown his bloodied uniform. Then just yesterday, we heard from Officer Jonathan Chi. He was shot after spotting Linthicum after Linthicum had been on the run for a day. WJZ investigator Mike Helgren has been in the courtroom for us all week. In his reporting, Chi got very emotional on the stand breaking down several times. Linthicum's defense attorney has been critical about the police response, saying officers should have been more cautious, especially given that Linthicum was considered suicidal and armed. Now, this trial is expected to last 10 days. That means both cases could rest, uh, both sides, excuse me, could rest their case by the end of next week. Reporting live on your corner in Towson, I'm Dennis Valera for WJZ 